Hi friends, Grace here. I hope you're well and you are having a lovely day. Welcome to this video, a short video where I want to give you some tips on what you can do to detoxify yourself from EMFs, that is electromagnetic frequencies. Now I was in the office a few weeks ago, usually I work from home but sometimes I have to go into the office. So I was in the office and we work in quite a big building and I was on the third floor just doing my work and then I looked across from me outside the window and what did I see on top of the other building? A big fat 5G tower and these towers they're putting them up in a lot of places but more discreet more on um, buildings so it's unnoticed to the public unless you're higher up so when I was at work I saw that and it troubled me a lot because a lot of people don't realize the dangers of Wi-Fi EMF waves and so on I believe it's a silent killer so um, what I want to do in this video is just give you some tips on what you can do to protect yourself now um if you have heavy metals in your body and a lot of people are laden with heavy metals i mean they're spraying it from the skies it's in all sorts of medications and so on and many people don't realize it that but they have high heavy metal toxicity and if you have heavy metals in your body then you're going to be more susceptible to emf poisoning and your body can actually be used as an antenna so what you want to do is detox and cleanse your body from heavy metals frequently and one way you can do that is to start by cleansing your colon now I don't know if I've spoken about this before on this channel but one particular herbal cleanse I like to do a few times a year which is very powerful is um, a herbal cleanse that involves a root herb called cascara sagranda, rhubarb root and the cassia bark now cascara saganda is powerful it's basically a natural laxative and what and it not only repairs your colon it helps your colon to contract to get things moving so if you're going to do this detox just make sure you stay at home and it will send you to the bathroom and get rid of all that waste so that's a good cleanse to do but while you're doing that cleanse, make sure you're drinking lots of water and add Himalayan salt to the water as well. That helps with your electrolytes. But it's a good way to detox and cleanse. And while you're doing that, you can be doing the green juice cleanse and fast as well. Now, powerful green juices that are good for heavy metals is chlorella, chlorella powder. You can add that to your juice and um, parsley as well. So just green juices in general, they're just a powerful way to cleanse the body, celery juice, all those things. If you can do something like that for three days, then you've done a great work at cleansing your body. Another good fruit juice that you can try is apple juice. Now, not the apple juice you buy from the store, but if you can get fresh apples, like here in Switzerland, it's like apple season. We've got so many apples, like um, we've harvested so what you might want to do is try an apple juice cleanse or pear juices they're like really good fruit juices they taste good and it's also a natural laxative so you might want to do that for a few days as well so it's just a good way to cleanse the body get it moving and then continue on with a wholesome balanced diet another thing you can do is get emf protective wear now what i have i've had this for about a year is that I have a, a canopy and um, it's made from like silver mesh and it just covers my whole bed, you know, like a mosquito in there, but it just covers everything. And then you have the mat at the floor and that acts as a barrier from EMF, Wi-Fi radiation. It just completely blocks it out. The material I have is like a silver mesh. It is quite expensive but I don't believe you can put a price on your health. So you can get that, I really recommend it. Or another material is Swiss Shield. That's really, really good as well. And if you just go on Google and, talk, and look up EMF canopy or 
um, EMF protection over your bed and so on and so on you should find something like that but it's something you definitely want to include because it just gives your body a rest from the com constant bombardment of all these frequencies um, attacking you um, another thing you might want to do is invest in EMF protection clothing after I saw that tower it troubled me a lot and um, thankfully we have a store in Switzerland which is completely dedicated to um, protective clothing emf protective clothing so i've got my stuff some you can get like vests and like shorts which is made from silver mesh and you just wear it under your clothing you know you just wear it under your clothing i also got some like comfy clothing i believe it's made from balm wood they're great protectors as well so if i'm at home working on the computer or working from home i like to just wear those and um, they have hats as well and caps i have like this silver thing sometimes that i put over my face and again, it just protects you from just this constant bombardment because studies are showing that it's a silent killer. It's linked to a lot of infertility, um, cancers, brain cancers, and so on and so on. So you just got to be careful. I mean, Satan is really trying to kill us, <laughs> you know, through, you know, destroy our immune system, you know, weaken our health. So these are little things that um, you want to just um, adopt in your lifestyle. And there's a lot of things I want to say, but I can't really talk too much about these things because the moment I say certain things, my videos get ta get taken down and I get blocked. But um, just, just try to implement those little things in your life and pray as well because this really is a serious battle. Nevertheless, I hope that helps. And I'm going to end the video here now. And God willing, you'll see or hear from me in the next video. Take care and God bless.